around this week when the revolution began, we still are waiting to see what will go down here tonight. But what about the tag team match? We already know it's going to go down tonight, Mike, today. Tony, can you believe it? Is it incredible? It's going to be Kevin Nash from the Wolfpack joining forces with the WCW World Heavyweight Champion Goldberg. What a formidable team that is against Hogan and the Giants. It's a very formidable team, but Goldberg has to remember, no matter what Kevin Nash says, how Lex Luger is smiling, Nash and the Wolfpack love what Goldberg and WCW have. Speaking of Goldberg, I want to let you know that this Thursday, the 27th, Goldberg is going to be at the Nassau Coliseum in Uniondale when tickets go on sale for our next Nitro in New York on Monday, November 9th. He can be Goldberg and many of the Nitro girls at the Coliseum in Nassau this Thursday, 10.30 to 12.30 when tickets go on sale at the box office and Ticketmaster locations. That notwithstanding, though, we have been hit with a bombshell tonight. Never thought I would see after all the... the, the animosity that's been building, the heat that's been building between the two. Thought I would see Kevin Nash, Big Sexy, and Goldberg as a team. I just wondered, did Goldberg want to bury the hatchet? Is that why he came out, stormed to the ring? Short and sweet, you want it, you got it. Just oh. like that, they're a tag team. Nostradamus wouldn't even have seen this one. It's Jim the Anvil Neidhart against K-Dog Conan of NWO Wolfpack here. You know, Wolfpack and K-Dog, I don't know what Viva La Rasa means, but I wouldn't buy a used car off this guy. Well, Mike knows what it means, don't you? Oh, it's a Reba La Rasa. It's a power to the people, to the race. There you go, see? Race a used car you'd buy from him. Neidhart down on the floor wants to slow things down. And, you know, as we talk about the Warrior Rebel revolution that he talked about and let, let's not forget the words from hollywood hogan that he said mr bischoff has the pen what he says goes there's no denying we all know this as much as we do not like the man as much as he has pledged allegiance to nwo hollywood and he bows in hollywood hogan eric bischoff runs things here so that's why we are concerned about the warriors appearance last week as it relates to war games as it relates to team wcw because bischoff said no in other words, what you're saying is the Warriors' promise to launch a revolution may be in jeopardy because of the power of Eric Bischoff. Well, I'm sure Bischoff will do whatever he can, but facts uh, speak louder than the pen. The Warrior was in the ring, and Bischoff couldn't stop him last week. We're going to hear from Diamond Dallas Page with news on war games, and especially on Team WCW, right to the back by Jim the Anvil Nidar. And fans, what a night it's shaping up to be. With Rowdy Roddy Piper and commissioner here with the revolution beginning and, of course, taking shape at any time, I must say. You never know when the Warriors going to arrive on the scene again tonight like he did last night with Goldberg and Kevin Nash being together here tonight as a tag team. This is the place to be because we are just off and running. We've got over two hours to go on this program. Here's a pickup and a big slam by Jim the Anvil Neidhart. Yeah, Anvil's a stout guy. He falls on you from here. K-Dog's lucky. K-Dog trying to time up. But he's there. got him. Conan's good on the mat. You can't deny that. And he's got the Anvil hooked here. He sure does. Tequila Sunrise hooked in the middle of the ring. It's over. How about it? K-Dog's your winner. Neidhart quickly taps out to avoid further pain and punishment. And Larry, NWO Wolfpack do rule. Well, I tell you, they're very good. You can't underestimate them. Conan is a very good wrestler, great submission man. I just don't know if I trust the man. We'll find out. Larry, this was so impressive. Let's take another look at Conan's submission victory over Jim the Anvil Neidhart. I'm sure Neidhart doesn't want to see this, but he made a big mistake there, and Conan's capitalized on it. Anvil didn't move quick enough, and look, Conan, look, watch how he sits over here. Puts the pressure right back on that shoulder and brings all the weight up over with that ankle. Very painful thing, and the Anvil had no choice but to say, Uncle. Looks like it's going to be a big evening for the NWO Red and Black attack. The Wolfpack starts off with a victory. Now let's go to Tony Schiavone. All right, Mike, today, thank you.